They're out to get me. How is this the second Gigas I've come into? Back to back, the second Gigas I've run into today. They're out to get me. They're honestly out to get me. This is, this is crazy. 21 game win streak? I'm actually terrified, you know, right now. The Gigas players are out to get me. We're just going to run up and fucking... Yeah, this guy's like one of the best players in Sweden. Uh, Emperor. Thought so. Uh, I tried to step, but I just ducked. <laughs> I just ducked and got launched. Oh my god. Yeah, I thought that would from that angle. Why do I keep doing that? There's something about it that just makes me feel like it's launched, but I know it's not. This is the same guy who beat the main man? It is, it is. Can I end his 21 game win streak though? That's, that's all I'm interested in. Uh, JR Hines, thank you so much for using your Twitch Prime subscription on me. You only get one of those. So thank you for letting me be the lucky recipient. Actually, it's Prime Gaming now, isn't it? It's Prime Gaming. Twitch changed it. Nice break. That's a complete guess. Oof, the range. I have to win this round, please. I have to win this round. I have to win this round. I have to win this round. No, I have to win this round. After, oh. Oh, after something like that, I have to win that round. Your emperor's mean for not letting me win that round. I'm upset. I'm upset. I'm so upset. Oh, I tried to jab instead of parrying that I normally do. Oh, whiff punish. Jesus Christ. Oh, almost. That's a gas count here only, isn't it? I can't. I deserve that round. <laughs> oh, and I ended the 21 game win streak. They should nerf the damage on that foreign throw since he gets a three, fo three follow up. No, they need to get rid of the follow up. I've been saying this for the longest time. It doesn't make sense having that follow up. Before the Oki, before the, the Oki before it used to be like intricate. You had to think. You're making a read on how you think they're going to get up. That's how it, that's how it should have been. Should be, you know, go back to that season one, season two, instead of where it is now. It's just, where it is now is just dumb. Oh, I thought that might evade running too. The follow-up is fine. No, the follow-up isn't fine. Because the follow-up into that Oki is stupid. That's The problem is the follow-up, not the throw damage.
Oops. Fuck. That's just unfortunate. Is Quarren better than Gigas? Is that even a question? <laughs> I, 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 that, that's, that's not a question. The answer should be obvious. Hug life, thank you for the follow. See, the thing with... The thing with Gigas, yeah? Is I've always said, I believe most characters in this game are viable. Well, Fergus even said it in his tier list. There's certain types of characters that should be bad. Gigas being one of them. Uh, Gigas being one of them, right? Because like some characters should not be good. I believe I really believe this in fighting games. And Gigas is a big sample. Imagine Gigas is up here. Can you imagine how obnoxious he would be? Like you cannot step him. So you, you can't step against this character. Uh, the thing with Gigas, and I think what a lot of people, I think what a lot of people missed because I don't think I explained it well enough. Because when I started explaining to people in the comments, they got it. Is when you look at Gigas, right? He's a tall character, good range, that's just meant to be just hit, just on, just pressuring you, right? Just on you, like, like, like jam on toast. Um, he's on you, right? I believe if you try and make a character like that good, you run the risk of him becoming too good. And like I said earlier, if you give Gigas a buff, that makes a difference it then probably ends up going too far in the other direction, right? Because look at him, tall character, long range. If you make buffs to certain things, you then give him the ability to dictate the pace of the match. And then we already have a character like that in the game right now, and that's fact. That's what I'm worried about. Giving Gigas significant buffs turns him into the next fact. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. I didn't mean to do that. I wanted to jab, but I was holding back at the same time. On you like flies on shit, basically, yeah. I'm not denying that Gigas is quite a bad character, but you know, Fergus says, is saying like, you know, you can't step this character. You really struggle to step this character. Like, yes, obviously there's things you can step. Um, Like it's not like you just, it's impossible to step, but like, there's a lot of things that have good tracking on it. If a character like that is good, it becomes very oppressive to play against. And that's what I talk about being worried about when it comes to this Gigas. Gigas is far from the next fact. Yeah, he is right now. I mentioned this in the podcast today. Dinosaur mentioned it as well a while ago um, about like the problem with making... So part of the reason why a character like fact is so good is because, you know, he's tall. Why Shaheen's good is he tall, right? The tall characters dictate range, dictate the pace of the match. Whether they get Gig Gigas more command grabs. I don't know why this this more command grabs thing is only like a, a thing they say about Gigas, right? Because every character added Tekken seven Tekken, sorry, Tekken six and onwards has never had why do I keep hitting my mic? Has never had more than just a one plus two throw. I I I don't understand why um I don't understand why it's Gigas the one that's like, he needs a new command throw, right? I can understand for like the type of character is why they say that, but when you when if you make Gigas good, you run the potential of him be becoming the next Ab you he could be Tekken's Abigail. And no one likes Abigail in Street Fighter. I'm not against giving Gigas a command though, I'm really not. I'm not against like fixing problems Gigas may have. Like I don't know every single character's problems in depth. I know Huarang's, I know Nina's problems. Um, like characters that have problems, I know like Lily has problems. I believe these are characters that need, like with Huarang, when I say he, you know, improve him, I mean just fix his hitbox problems. 
he needs things taken away. It's never just a case of like, I was like, oh, Gigas needs nurse, but I hope Huarin gets more buffs, I said. And I say over and over again, I do not want Huarin to get more silly buffs. But people only hear what they want to hear, right? Uh, how's it going, Emideus? It's actually a uh, very late evening for me. But good morning to you. Lei has issues? Same, right? I don't know why they made while setting two hit. That should that while setting two thing hit confirmable, more delayable, right? Like I just because I use Huarang as an example. I'm worried that with the way the balancing team has gone about buffing certain characters, if they do try and buff Gigas, they're going to give him something silly. Dragon is a fourteen from punish because his standing punish is garbage, but he has the. He has the best while standing punishment in the game, right? That's like a trade-off for it. And Drag has very good poking and control the neutral very well. You know? It's like, I believe characters should have weak weaknesses. You know, Huarang, for example, his punishment is not the best. He doesn't control the neutral well. His poking isn't fantastic. But he has a good pressure game and good damage. And you've got to play into those strengths. Why am I anti-Gigas? I'm not anti-Gigas. I'm anti-buffing Gigas in a silly way like they always do. Like, if you look at some of the buffs the balancing team have gone, gone about with, Imo, thanks for the follow. Like, making Huarang's RFS back three minus 10. The two throw follow-up, which I still believe is unintentional. Um, Eliza's Moonglide 4. They just give silly buffs. Oh, very good whiff punish. Oh, he's very good at um baiting things with just safe buttons and backdash right that's something um galanda did very well against double in the lcq finals right just do a, a safe button like maybe like a while sending for so you know gigas as well but like a while sending for backdash bait the button immediate with punish right he's very good at that didn't mean to do that nice punish Too early. Sorry, too late, even. Move the new move is going to be for Gigas. I don't know. A backflip. They're going to give Gigas a backflip. New power crush. Uh, big margin. Thank you for the. Is that a raid? That. Thank you for the raid. Is that big margin the uh, last player big margin? Is it Lars? Oh, 
Ooh, the lag spike. I think another thing that needs to be addressed as well is I think Tekken's in a place right now where you don't really need to be buffing characters. Uh, maybe the follow as well, Big Margin. Um, if anything, I think you just need to start nerfing, right? Nerf characters, tone characters down. Oh, Water, thank you for the follow. Nerf, tone a few characters down here and there. But then, but there are some characters who do need some help, like Lily with her stuff, like her down forward one, I think. I saw a video of John Ding. Uh, I saw a video of John Ding playing against Lohai using Eddie. Uh, Kenpachi White, thanks for the follow. And he did slippery kicks. The first hit of slip kicks connected. The second hit didn't. And then Lohai just rage at him. Right? Stuff like that is just... If the move hits, let it hit. I don't know if you guys can hear that outside, but uh, it's it's a storming up here. Oh, he must have neutral blocked. Buff Rang's running three hitbox? Yes. Yes. Make it an actual mid, right? Nina has more hitbox problems than I can count, you know? This is the stuff I think needs to be touched. What was that epic? Sh what is what is he doing? Why is that a high? It doesn't look like a high. It doesn't look like a high. Nina's hitbox problems are out of control. One hundred percent. Ouch. Nerf everyone but Buff Warang. At no point did I say that, but you know some people are just going to misconstrue it as that's what I said, right? Like I said, people only hear what they want to hear. What is he doing? What is going on right now? Perfect does need plus plus right by this. I do think Feng could get some buffs here or there. Desync? That could have been a desync. Um That could have been a desync. But GG's to Emperor anyway. Imagine if the next person I run into is another Gigas. That'd be my third Gigas in a row. <laughs> 